Today we are going to crochet a hollow bag with a leaf pattern. Now we are using the milk cotton of 5 grains. The crochet hook used is 2.5 millimeters. Next, let's crochet together. Our bag consists of two such woven pieces combined together. This pattern can also be used as a coaster cushion. Let's start by crocheting a single unit flower. First, tie a knot on the finger. Insert the crochet hook into the starting loop. Crochet 3 braids. 1 2 3 Then wrap the yarn around the hook. Return to the first stitch. Crochet a long stitch. First, wrap the yarn around the hook. Insert into the stitch. Pull up a loop. Now there are three loops on the hook. First, pull the yarn through the first two loops. Then pull the yarn through the last two loops. This is the method for a long stitch. After crocheting, there will be a hole in the middle. The leaves behind us is crochet through this hole. Coil elongation. Crochet winding. And through this hole in the middle. Six unfinished mid long needles. Once. Twice. Three times. Fourth. Three times. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Six uncompleted mid length stitches after completion. We'll hook the wire. Two coils at once. This is the first time. Then hook the wire. Pull the two coils again. This is the second time. Crochet winding. Pull through two coils. This is the third time. Crochet winding. Pull through two coils. This is the fourth time. Crochet winding. Pull through two coils. This is the fifth time. Crochet winding. Pulled through. All coils. This is the sixth time. That's the end. Then turn the sheet over. Wrap the hook around the yarn. On the other side. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, hook six incomplete medium long stitches. Then wrap the hook around the yarn. Pass through two loops. Wrap 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 the yarn. Pass through all remaining loops. The other side is the same. A total of six passes through the loops. Like this. We have completed the leaf part. Next, switch to white yarn. 
Directly insert the loops. First bring in. The loops are long. Wrap the hook around the yarn. For the first group, we pick the front vertical strand. For the back, we pick the loop formed on each side of the stitch. Forming 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Picking the edge forms this knot. Two, three, four, five. Six. Then wrap the hook around the yarn. Pass through two loops. Fasten off the yarn. Push through two coils. Wind the wire. Push through two coils. Wind the wire. Push through two coils. Hold this piece and flip it over. Hold the other piece. What about the other piece? Also stop. This. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Pick the side of this one. One. Two. Three, four, five, six. Then hook and wind the wire. Push through two coils. Wind the wire and push through two coils. Then hook. One. Two. Two upright pins. Flip the paper. After flipping, we form the winding. In the center position. Center position. Insert. Hook and weave. An unfinished long needle. Next. Mix the green thread. Pull the front roll long. Turn the winding. Then the power in the center. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Push the thread. One, two, three, four, five, six, straight film flip. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Five. Six. Flip. After flipping, change to white thread. First, pull it long. Jump here. One. Two. 
three, four, five, six. Then hook the needle and wind the thread. Retreat the thread. One, two, three, four, five, six. Flip the film. On the other side. Pick up the threads in order. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Hook the needle around the thread. Retreat the thread. One. Two. Three, three, two, two, three, four, five, six, one. Two. Turn this piece over after flipping. Hook an unfinished long stitch. Then switch to green thread. Then pull it longer. Continue hooking. The third leaf. We need to hook six leaves in the first row. After six leaves are completed, we knit a lock needle together. Cut the thread. Pull out the thread end. In this way, we have completed the first row. Next, we start knitting the second row. The second row needs to be pieced and connected at the same time. First, we will work on the second row. Complete the green part of the first leaf. Next, connect in the white part. Then switch to white thread. Insert the thread. Pull the loop longer. Hook around the thread. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Ten. Six. Construct it like this. Let's see how it is connected. And the first row. Compare how it is placed. We need to pay attention here. Pointed end facing up, flat side facing down. When placing, pointed end facing up, flat side facing down. Place it next to the first petal. When we piece it together, correspondingly thread through the first petal, one bottommost, two inside this section, three hook the needle and wrap the thread, four create a coil, five continue hooking the needle and wrapping the thread, six first pull through the first group of coils, seven wrap the thread and pull through the second group of coils, eight wrap the thread and pull through the third group of coils, 9. Wrap the thread and pull through the 4th group of coils. 10. Wrap the thread and pull through the 5th group of coils. 11. Wrap the thread and pull through the 6th group of coils. 12. This way, we will join the first leaf together. 13. Next, we will hook the other side of the leaf normally.
14 this leaf is completed 15 next set up two standing needles 16 flip the branch piece flip it over and hook a long needle that is not completed Seventeen next, switch to green thread and hook the second leaf. Eighteen lengthen the coil. Nineteen one, two, three, four, five, six. Twenty then flip the paper. Twenty one after flipping, switch to white thread. Twenty two first, lengthen it. Twenty three then pick the thread. A. Second. Three. Four. Five. So, what about this? We found the second leaf. This aligned. In the second leaf. In the bottom coil. Penetration. Bring out a coil. Then hook the wire. Push through the first coil. Push through the second set of coils. Push through the third coil. Push through the fourth coil. Push through the fifth coil. Push through the sixth coil. So the second leaf, and we're connected. What's next? Repeated crochet. We have six patterns in a row. There are four rows. And then knot and the line. According to the method of the group case, crochet two pieces, and then two? Back opposite back. Start with a standing stitch. And then in this needle in the center. And then through the posterior piece. The central order, the order of the needle. Crochet a short stitch together. Then continue to crochet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. After completing the 8 lock stitches, move to the second leaf. First pass through the center of the front leaf. Then pass through the center of the back leaf. Pull the loop out, crochet a short stitch. Then continue to crochet 8 lock stitches. 3, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Pass through the center of the bottom leaf. Crochet a short stitch. 
Then continue to crochet 8 lock stitches. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Watch me finish the bottom. Finishing the bottom like this. Next crochet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The corner is 8 stitches. Then come to the leaf. This position. Pass through together. Crochet a short stitch. Next. Connect the side two stitches with six stitches in between. One, two, three, four, five, five, six. And then connect it here. Good. So we'll have the edges on one side of the line. Next, continue to crochet the right amount of braid stitches. As part of our bag, you can put it on our shoulders. How long will it take? We'll just knit a few braids. When the tape is finished, we came to the other side of the bag. Threw them together. The first order of the leaves of the first group. Crochet a short stitch. Then hook the edges. Edge portion. We're crochet six braids. Then. Second group of leaves. A short stitch is knitted on the first stitch. Six braid pins. On the first order of the leaves of the third group, crochet a short stitch. We repeat the crochet later. We crochet 8 braiding needles at the corner. And at the stitch of the first short needle, crochet a pulling needle to connect. Then crochet a standing needle, cut the thread, pull out the thread end.
This is a very beautiful leaf decoration pouch. We are done. Thank you everyone.